from the University of California at Davis. This is News Watch. With a cut of the ribbon, UC Davis opened its newest veterinary medical laboratory designed to provide stem cells to horses to treat bone, tendon, and ligament injuries. Thousands of horses suffer these kinds of injuries every year. If you go across the spectrum of horses, it's probably the number one training-related and use-related injury that horse owners see. In the past, treatment consisted of rest and lots of anti-inflammatory drugs. Now, with the use of stem cells, the goal is to regenerate healthy tissues so the animal can be as sound as it was before the injury. The difference is we were able to heal tendons before, but we held, healed them with a scar, scar tissue. What we're doing with stem cells is healing that tissue with its own natural, with tendon tissue, with natural tissue. So we're recreating the, the damaged tissue in a natural way. That's the big difference. Clients will usually pull bone marrow and collect it in a in a, in a bag for us. Once they send it to us, we put it into a system called the AXP, which isolates the stem cells. Once those stem cells are isolated, we give them to the regenerative medicine lab techs, and then they culture and process them. If stem cells offer perhaps one-tenth of the promise that we hope they do, that both us and human researchers hope that they do, it may be akin to the discovery of penicillin. Stem cell procedures may soon be available to dogs. Paul Fotenauer reporting from UC Davis. For more information, please log on to broadcast.ucdavis.edu.